So then we got to see the hangman again. Did you know hangman Adam Page, Brian, has blocked me on Twitter? Yeah, I remember we discovered that a little while back. We had to look for something, and he blocked you. That's he blocked right. me That's as well. Right. That's, That's right. right. Well, listen, somebody else sent me something where the page had said, and and. It, that's why. Oh, that's what it was. Because Paige apparently was talking about something Booker T had said. Because Booker T made fun of Adam Cole's diminishing physique, and so. But when Paige said something about old people with podcasts, everybody thought it was me, and they tried to send me the the thing. But of course, it doesn't show up on mine because I'm blocked. But that's why another reason I twin tr- I twinded I trended on Twitter last week or whenever because. <laughs> Oh God! Damn. So anyway, Adam pa- Adam Page basically is a uh, not only a fake cowboy, but apparently a very easily insulted and feeling hurt whiny little bitch. Also, so he wrestles Silas Young, the last real man who's actually from Milwaukee and worked for Ring of Honor. So he's probably getting a look see. They put Adam Cole on color because he can't wrestle. He's wearing the black leather jacket and the what looks like women's yoga pants now because they're tight on his bird legs. Uh, You know, as a matter of fact, did you hear that Adam Cole recently won a big legal fight? Legal fight? No, I hadn't heard anything about that. He sued both his legs for non-support and won. Come on, come on. Um, (laughs) I I like Adam. How many times I said great shit about Adam? He goes there and the whole thing falls in a hole. And now it's summertime. I know he's injured. He was wearing street clothes. I don't expect him to look like Lex Luger while he's out hurt, but he hasn't seen the sun in a year and a half. How It's summertime. Does he go for... I have a tan from going out in the yard with my limb lopper. So they had a match, Paige and Silas Young, and Paige did the blind moonsault off the top again like he does in every match perfectly despite the fact that he took his eyes off his opponent for 16 seconds by my count they go to the break they come back the first move back from the break is page superplexes silas young off the top rope and in this case they both actually sell it and nobody even goes for a cover remember they'll do the superplex where they'll land and the one guy will put his legs up and the other guy will fucking hook them which kills the superplex. In this case, the guy that gave the superplex sold it as long as the guy that took it. Nobody even went for a cover. And then Silas Young, who looks like a wrestler, but tried and succeeded in doing a flip, did a triple Lindy flip out of a handstand on the top rope and landed on his feet because Paige had moved. (laughs) So literally, Silas Young does a headstand on the top rope Bounces off of that, lands with his ass on the top rope, does a backflip, lands on his feet, and Paige just German suplexes him. Clotheslines him, hits him with a buckshot lariat. One, two, three, thanks for showing up. And then Adam Cole comes to the entranceway with the microphone, and apparently he's going to talk to Paige. But here comes Sling Blade Jay White, and he interrupts. And remember, he is Adam Cole's friend. Cole said, here's my friend Jay White, and they're friends. Well, as they were standing there looking at each other, Brian, did you notice that Adam Cole and Sling Blade Jay White look like brothers? Both have a beard. Both have dark hair. Both have hair pulled back in a fucking ponytail or a bun or something. Both of them are wearing a jacket with kind of flousy fucking sleeves, and they both look like if they turn sideways and stick their tongue out, they look like a zipper. They're about 170 pounds piece and approximately the same height. So, and as slovenly dressed as Adam Cole is, Sling Blade Jay White is also slovenly dressed. So now we've got two unkempt. 170 pounders with ponytails doing wrestling promos at each other. It looks like a cable access show where the fans get to come up and do wrestling promos. Who is approving what these guys wear on television? Anybody? Nobody. How the fuck can that be? Have you seen what Tony's been wearing? Well, he's not on TV. I don't care if he comes in his pajamas. 
which he probably does instead of other female anatomy right, parts. Right, but stop nevertheless, it. stop it. I'm just, I just, it was there. It was there. I had to take instead of other female anatomy parts. <laughs> but seriously, nobody is telling these guys. You look like a fucking moron. You look like a goddamn repairman. You look like the Jiffy Lube guy. You're supposed to be a television star, unless it's your gimmick. If your gimmick is a f the the Godwins or a hillbilly or whatever the fuck, everybody's wearing sweatpants or these tight jeans, a fucking t-shirt, a frousy fucking jacket, if that, the same hair, just pull it back and put a fucking rubber band around it, they look like people on a fucking street. And I didn't usually have to critique what guys were wearing on television when I was in charge of any company, anywhere, because most of the time they knew they're stars on television. They're going to go out in their tights and they're going to be oiled and they're going to be tanned. They're going to look good. Or they're going to be out in street clothes. They need to fuck unless it fits their gimmick. They need to be dressed up like they're somebody. And if you did have to tell somebody, you didn't have to generally tell them more than once. So again, this is why that this looks so amateur. And why when you leave these guys to their own devices, the WWE looks like a professional network organization and this looks like local television not the production the content so sling blades out there and he ain't gonna fight adam cole because adam cole lost to page so then jay white just tells page or tells cole he's not gonna fight him because you lost to him twice and walks to the ring and leaves adam cole standing there now they've got Jay White, a guy that's not even signed to a full-time contract or exclusive contract of the company that's just told off Adam Cole and left him standing there with no rebuttal like a lost child on a street corner while he walks to the ring and he's going to tell Paige off. But they get in a fight and then Adam Cole comes in and nutshots Paige and they both get heat on Paige. But then... Cole teases hitting White with the title belt, but White catches him. And suddenly they play music again. And then here comes a blonde Japanese guy in t-shirt and sweatpants that looks like a fucking Japanese M&M. And it's, it's Okada, supposedly one of their top guys in all of New Japan, who looks like a fucking parking attendant. And he gets in the ring, and Okada and Paige have a sloppy fight with the heels and then stare at each other like they're going to fight, but then they turn around and go back to fighting the heels. So Jay Slingblade White is supposed to be the world champion of New Japan Pro Wrestling. He looks like Ned with a scraggly, unkempt beard, pulled back hair, and he doesn't look any bigger than fucking Adam Cole. Oh, yes, he does. Not much. I'm talking body weight, not height. And then Okada, with the bad bleach job for no reason, and they had a sloppy fight. When do any of the... When, how is this designed for any of these people that we have not seen on the television before to make an impact and an impression on people seeing them for the first time. We have seen countless people debut on the show in street clothes. Well, Will Ospreay wore a robe, I'll give him credit. But in street clothes, just coming out there while Excalibur screams their name, and Excalibur is not an effective commentator unless you're in on whatever he's doing. Then he's just yelling names, you have no idea what he's even saying. I wouldn't have done any of this stuff if I was building up an interpromotional pay-per-view at New Japan. This is not the way I would have done anything. What's Okada's two greatest moves in a wrestling match? Do you have any idea? Uh, well, the Rainmaker is his biggest move, and that's like his short arm lariat. So I would say that's his biggest one. He's got two good moves, right? Yes, everyone has at least two okay, good moves. Okay, then here's what you do. Goddamn... Adam Cole and Jay Slingblade White have their issues amongst themselves. They've said they're friends, but also they're being pissy with each other and White ain't going to fight Cole. But Cole still 
doesn't like Page. So when White and Page get in the fight, then fucking Cole comes in, nut shots Page from behind, and both the heels get on this motherfucker, and they've got him set up to where they're going to give a double fucking paralyzing move to goddamn old poor old Adam Page, and without music or play the music, but let him run in tights and boots if he's got a physique, couldn't look any worse than he did in those street clothes. Here comes Okada, he hits the ring, and he gives one of his big moves to Cole, and he gives the other big move to fucking White, and looks like a world beater, and goddamn, the heels scamper out on the floor and with shock on their face, oh my God, he's here, so it makes a big deal to them, and the guy looks like he can do something, and we don't have time to see through the fact that he can't do a lot of this other stuff because the fight was sloppy as shit, and he's made an impact, and he looks like somebody. Instead, we get sloppy fight, street clothes, nobody understands, they're, they're for each other, they're against each other, they're on each other's side, what the fuck? But none of these people are coming out and being put in a spotlight to make a statement or an impact or have a 30-second flurry where they are the center of attention, and they look better than everybody else. And that's the only way that you debut somebody on a surprise run-in and get them over. Elsewise, it's just these guys have staggered out there for a personal appearance in the fucking ring. Who gives a shit? 